When you're crimping an end on the cable, the first thing you want to do is strip off enough of this shielding so that you can get to the internal wires and they're easy to work with. For me, that's about two to three inches. So I'll take my cable stripper, put it on there right about there. Twist that cable around and boom, pull it off. Now I'm going to separate each one of these twisted pairs of wires. That allows me to get to this big chunk of insulation in the middle. Now I'm going to use the cable cutter to chop that right out of there. And then I'll untwist each one of these pairs of wires. You want to untwist it as far down as you can, right to that shielding. There we go. Individual wires. Orange, orange stripe. Blue stripe, blue. Brown stripe, brown. Green, green stripe. Now I'm going to arrange these wires in whatever standard I'm trying to match. T568A and T568B. If you punched in the patch panel as T568A, then arrange these in T568A. If you made them B, make them B. If you match an A to a B, meaning on this side we wire it T568A, and on the other side we wire it T568B, we've technically made what's known as a crossover cable. So our patch panel is wired with T568A, I'm gonna match that. Green stripe, green. Orange stripe, blue. Blue stripe, orange. Ah, they're starting to fight me. Because of all the twists, you're gonna have to kind of wiggle these things out and keep them straight. Brown stripe, brown. Now you can see I'm just moving and wiggling these cables to get them to stay the way I have them. They're always going to try and move back to the way they're twisted inside of the shielding. The reason I'm doing this is we need to put on here this tip. And this is why I like the tips that allow you to slide through the wires best is because you can get them all in the right order right up here at the top, slide them in, and then cut off the excess right at the end of this tip. So I'm going to get just enough that I need to slide through there, right about there. Take my cable cutter and snip off the rest. There we go. Green stripe green, orange stripe blue, blue stripe orange, brown stripe brown. All right, we'll take that tip and try and slide them in there. There we go. Now we just pull the excess through until you reach the point where you've got the shielding inside of that tip. I'll take my cutters and do a little chop just so it's not so unruly. I'll take my tip and put it inside of the crimpers, which also has a cutter on the other end, and crimp it down. Notice all these little pieces just fell off on the other end. We've now crimped an end on the cable. 